I'm a warrior. I love competition. I'm all about battle. Like, I can't wait to beat this guy. It's just that fight, man. Like, I've fought for everything. My whole life, I've, I've been fighting. Hey guys, this is Justin Williams of Vice Sports POV. Ah, uh, it's funny. I missed, like, the first half lap because I didn't turn the camera on. If you've never been to a Red Hook race and there's one near you, you should go. It's just like a very positive, very easygoing community. And I think that's something that sets it apart from other forms of cycling. Fixed gear racing is criterium racing on a closed circuit. It's usually like about a mile and you're on a bike with no brakes and the only a form of slowing down you have is to backpedal. If you've ever ridden a track bike before, you understand like the aspect of backpedal. It's, it's all momentum control. It's kind of just like finding the rhythm. Everyone's trying to figure out what the course is like and, and how it flows and figuring out where they want to ride, who's strong, who's doing what, who's riding aggressive, who's giving space. You're trying to pick up on all these little details of your competition. It's a sport where you have no brakes, your handlebars are about 44 centimeters wide, and sometimes you're in positions where you can't slow down and you have to move through something. And if you're, if you're good at being physical, then you can kind of wiggle your way through. I'm a super physical rider. I don't think I'm very physical, but I'm a super physical rider. And yeah, it's, sometimes you have to be physical. I think this is the furthest back I've ever been. And you'll start to see people diving and that's exactly where you don't want to be. So I'm about 15, 15, 20 back right now. You see a guy just dove across my front wheel and I have to like see him come and give him space so that again, we both don't crash. But now I'm like, okay, I got to get to the front. Brain is really interesting. It makes it harder to draft. It makes your everything gets heavy because you, you start to get soaked, your feet get wet and cold, man. It's it's everything. And now it's one lap to go and it's just like full gas. And Stefan had taken like a three lap pull or something incredible and he's still on the front. It's like half a lap to go. Alec hits it beautifully, slides into the corner like a G. takes it perfectly, I'm behind him. And this is where I feel like I made a little bit of a mistake. He's super quick and he's on a small gear and he goes out of the corner and I gap him because we call it taking a run. So I'm like, oh, I'm gonna take a run at him. And I take a run at him and I come up on him quicker than I think I'm gonna come up on him. And then I kind of hesitate for a second. And in the end, you know, losing by half a half a wheel, that, that could have made all the difference. What I love so much about Red Hook is that second, third, fourth, fifth, if you're in the top five, you're in the top 10, like it comes with so much respect. And I can appreciate that. And again, if my guys are happy at the end of the race, I have no choice but to be happy. Oh, so good, man. Dude. What a fuck. Fuck yeah, man. man.